heightened tensions in the Korean Peninsula, North Korea has now threatened to turn the Pacific into a quote-unquote firing range. Seoul's military has said that Pyongyang also launched three more ballistic missiles off its east coast. This comes just a day after U.S. along with South Korea and Japan staged joint air drills in the Korean Peninsula. North Korean media confirmed that the country launched two projectiles from a multiple rocket launcher. The missiles were aimed at targets more than 300 kilometers away. Japan's defense ministry confirmed that the two of the three ballistic missiles traveled a distance of more than 350 kilometers and fell outside its exclusive economic zone. However, there were no reports of damage to aircraft or vessels. Information about the third missile launch was not given immediately by Japan. The ministry also said that it would continue to gather and analyze information in close cooperation with the United States. The missile launch has been condemned by the United Nations. On the other hand, North Korean leader's powerful sister Kim Yo-jong has warned against the presence of U.S. strategic assets on the Korean Peninsula. She said that using the Pacific as a firing range depends upon the United States forces action. She also defended the effectiveness of what she called sudden missile launch, saying South Korea did not even fly reconnaissance planes at the time of its launch. The missile launch is Pyongyang's third major weapons test this year. It has been done just two days after it tested another long-range ballistic missile. Such tests are part of North Korea's unprecedented, persistent and strong response, which it has vowed against the joint drills of the United States and its allies. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.